Hello, my name is Dan, and welcome to Team Theme. Today, I'll be ranking my top 5 rides at Poulton's Park. Those expecting a shout out, don't worry, but they are now at the end of the video. Let's jump straight in. Number 5 At number 5, we have the River Ride. This log flume may have a short cycle and no theming, but at least there is some sort of way of cooling down on a hot summer's day, since this is the park's only water ride, excluding the splash and play area. However, in the next few years, I wouldn't be surprised and it might receive some theming, but at least you can get a good old soaking. Number 4 the fourth ride on our list is The Edge. This flat ride fits lovely in the family themed park with it being fun and enjoyable for most age groups. It is surrounded in the lovely gardens and a well kept queue line, with it featuring a camel hump in the middle of the track to make it extra special, which makes it definitely deserve the name Edge. Number 3 Thirdly, I have the recently refurbished ride at the Critter Creek section, going by the name of Cato Pillar. Originally once named the Flying Frog, this ride has now been fully overhauled and themed beautifully, enhancing children's experience. It may only be a kiddie coaster, but it is the overall experience that counts. The park is fortunate to have this roller coaster. Number 2 Second on my list is the Cobra. It is fair to say this wild mouse is one of the most intense rides on the park, with the trains themed to the Cobra Snake and the track featuring a hedgehopper and painful turns throughout. This roller coaster only lacks theming, but overall it is a decent ride and beats Rattlesnake at Chessington World of Adventures, in my opinion. Before we announce my favourite ride on park, I would like to announce some honourable mentions to Velociraptor, Magma and all rides at Peppa Pig World, which couldn't make it in the top 5. Number 1 Of course, number 1 had to go to Flight of the Petrosaur. It is fair to say this roller coaster is a fairly new one, with it opening for the 2016 season with the dinosaur themed area Lost Kingdom. This suspended roller coaster was a massive leap for the park because it is about the experience more than it is of the thrills. However, you do get a good sensation on the helix, and the ride feels really smooth throughout, unlike Vampire at Chessington but without all of the animatronic dinosaurs in the queue line and all of the foliage, this ride wouldn't be at number one. So well done to Poulton's Park for your awesome ride selections. So, that's my list over, but before we end I have a few shout outs, with the first shout out going to Thomas Park My Land, the second going to Top Thrill Dragster Productions, and finally, Bubble Sup Kids. As always, you can access these channels in the description below. Make sure to request your shout out in the next video and to request the next top 5. My name is Dan and you have been watching Team Theme. Thank you and good night.